Hello and welcome back to the RTG. And in that last one, if you missed it, we made history. Prime R9 being packed, madness. So in this one today, I was wanting to improve our defense. Instead of playing a right back out of position, I went and upgraded the center back role. Also gone unlocked one of the sweatiest players to ever grace ultimate team, and he's back. So you'll enjoy it. And if you do, thumbs up, subscribe, click that bell. And if you want in game codes, check out my sponsor, Start Select. Use the code Fuji22 on that site to get yourself instant delivery in all codes and a discount. Down, go and check him out. So we do start off with some sad news. Gucci out, R9 in. It's the R9 era. And one of the main reasons why I got rid of him, that price right there is concerning. For him to not have any more interest, open bids, when he was recently selling for 3.9, I want out. So not only have we made profit, but now we've freed up a ton of coins that I can do some nice trading with. And as well as the leftovers, I can improve that side. But I got some 75 plus packs and I want to show you the best. So all of these like average cards and playable cards do. Whoa, 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 Di Maria. Wow, 89 informed Di Maria. Well, that is going to be put towards Mbappe most likely. That came out of nowhere. One of the best players in this week's team of the week. How much is he? 50,000 coins. That seems fairly cheap for an 89 inform. 1 mil 50 for a team of the Marquinhos. Oh no, we're going to be buying Maldini moments. Not right now. In the next couple of months, Maldini will arrive and we're getting the best version. I don't want that stinking prime. I want the best of the best when it comes to Maldini. We treat him with respect. Marquinhos, new signing, new center back. He's in. Good price. I mean, we could have got him for 1 mil 50, 1 mil 60. I don't mind. So welcome our latest signing, Marquinhos Team of the Year. Fantastic stats for his prize. But unfortunately, I don't believe we're going to be able to unlock his teammate, Mbappe. 12 days remaining, and we're needing to gather up all that fodder. Impossible. So instead of Mbappe, I was looking at Ryan Kin. Not too bad on his price. Good stats as well. And he was so OP back in the day. So playoffs was calling. Let's go and test out these cards. Marquinhos, R9, and Ryan Kent. You know, we downgrade a little bit with Kent. But first game, mm, don't know, don't know. We've got to warm up. Yo, where's the team at? Great opportunity. Hang on a minute. Edwin. All right, R9, I just got to try and get into him. Give it to him. Move, 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 move. No, I've got something to do here. Get, get out of the way. I've got something to do here. I need goals with R9. This man, but budget side. Oh, damn, that's a good finish. He's ridiculous in front of goal, yeah. His finishing's crazy. I mean, there are better dribblers than R9, but that's why we really need to find an insane strike partner. I mean, this Ken, as, as good as he may be, I don't think he's going to be... Oh, hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. The double ball roll? Whoa. Hang on. Maybe he will be his strike partner. Hey, some goal from Ryan Ken. Jesus, that was smooth, you know. R9. You ready? R9, don't you dare stop that run. Don't you dare. What I want is I want you powering him. But... I think he just ran away. He was intimidated. His right center back literally just went backwards. Next match in the playoffs. We're going to be testing out a new formation. Go on, Ken. I mean, he is moving all right on the ball, I must say. Oh, that was so smooth. Go on, go on, R9. Don't be shy. Yes. <laughs> oh, don't leave. I feel like R9 is going to get better. Game three. The... Give me that Cancelo. Power, pace. Wide, wide, wide. Set that back. <laughs> oh, nine. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Get out of his way. Over your head, R9. And over your head. Oh! <laughs> Please. Play, play him as a center back. Or, or like in a 3-5-2, three, three, it'd be perfect. Like right center back. Ken. Damn. Oh, Vieira. Sorry, I got it, Marquinhos. Let's go, boys. Flick it on, please. Go on then, Cruyff. Fake shot cancel. I always say fake shot cancel. Shot cancel. God damn. We continue. Zidane Prime. McKenny. 
The prime pack or prime Oak. Hold on a minute, push gas. What a save. Damn, see that. <laughs> I, just, I just did a fake pass with Caligiuri. Damn, that speed from Puskas, though, caught me off guard. Mine, Cancelo. Right, you want to see how good Kent is? All right, hold on. I've got to actually get the ball to him first. Marquinhos, love that. Good. On Mbappe. The way he shifts it, man, he's, he really is technical. Lively. Like, bang. Hold on. There we go. Oh, let me pass. Good strength, though. Good aggression, Kent. Yes. Well done, Kent. Fighting for the team, playing for the badge. I don't, yeah, I don't know what it is. It just feels like too... I don't know. Maybe I've never used the proper tactics or the right tactics for the formation. Or maybe the instructions are a bit weird. Throw on on. Oh, good header. Oh, fantastic. Hey, Marquinhos. I mean, you are playing for me right now. What have we got next? Hullet. A bit of rude Hullet. I respect it, though. Oh, no. Oh, go on. Oh, no. Come on. You got to give me that. Damn. Oh, no. In this match feels really agile. Some games, I must say, you do feel a little bit of a drag with him. But that's more the connection. When it's like this, you know, you can really manipulate that ball. It feels so good. His left stick control. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. Lewandowski. Oh, no. He's trying to be a weirdo. He's trying to hold the ball in this area. No, thank you. Where's Ken? Oh, wow. Hold on a minute. Hold it. Hold it. Cheat. Absolute cheat. Wow, we are really open here. Well done, Marquinhos, though. Clean challenge and came away with it. That's important. Just keep running this way. Go! R9 speed. Wait for it. Good. Johan Cruyff. See? The composure from R9. He takes his time. Oh, that would have been so sick. The reverse through ball there to Ken to finish it off. That would have been really nice. Lewandowski. Stop it. He's, he's trying to... Oh, no. I don't know. Just chip it over over the... Oh, Christ! Ramos! I've never, ever seen that from a defender. What the hell? That is some agility from Ramos. I am impressed. Gotta go constant pressure. Plus! That was lucky, though. How dare you? Who was that on the ball? My goodness me, that really purposely stopped that ball from going to R9. Focus, come on, let's not fail on this penalty shootout. We've been good recently. Ramos has had one of the best games I've ever seen a centre back. Oh. Oh, Kalajuri. Lewandowski, which way? Which way are you going, Lewandowski? Which way are you going? Middle? Wow, that was a, that was a good pen. His head didn't even move. What a bad pen. That was so bad. He's out of stamina. That was such a bad pen. Middle, 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 middle. Oh, good pen, Carlos Alberto. I didn't want to mess up there. Oh, which way, which way, which way? He's going right again. Oops. I rushed it. That was a bad pen. All right, I think he's going to go in the middle. Good call. Fantastic call. Patrick. Good penalty. Thank you, sir. Mbappe. Oh, whoa, calm down, Mbappe. Oh. Yeah, we haven't. Good switch up. He's looking at the left-hand side. He's looking at the left. I'm going left. I'm going left. Oh, wow. <sighs> Tammy. Oh, who's that? <laughs> who's that? Oh, that uh, SBC. Oh, come on. Cancelo. Right, he saw my head movement. 100% saw my head movement. I'm going right. Yes, good bait. Good bait. Good bait. Cancelo. What a win. So we did start the playoffs pretty well, and then everything just collapsed on me. Well, no, literally everything was going wrong. So I have to move on and accept rank three. 
uh, which is terrible, really. I'm usually getting good ranks in the playoffs, but I don't know, just past few days has been really hit and miss for me on the game. So I'm going to be testing some new formations and fix up the team. Now, R9, we already know that he is a phenomenal striker. Mad finishing, really good pace on the last man. So alongside him, I need to bring in someone that complements that. Dribbling, skilling, and just can feed the beast. So 2.9 million coins we have remaining after having bought Marquinhos, which I think is going to be a fantastic signing for us. With that jockeying speed pace, he can play wide center back in a three or right bang in the middle. It doesn't make any difference as long as he's playing well. So let's say 2 million coins I'm going to invest into cards to make money. And then 900,000 will have free to make a really nice striker upgrade. Or it could technically be a cam if we play Cruyff striker alongside R9. So we are still looking for a fantastic striker. So before you guys say anything about old foods, he sold saying, what is he doing? Hear me out. 3.7 million, 26 minutes remaining, no interest. This man two days ago was selling for 3.9 comfortably. So I think we've got out at the right time. Maybe, in fact, too late. I could have made like an extra 100,000 coins if I sold him when I was debating whether or not to get rid of him. And obviously not because he is bad in any way. It's just a lot of money and, and I feel like he is going to tank. I think he's going to go down to like 3.2, 3.3 million, maybe even less. And it's not because I want to drive his price down. I've just got a feeling that someone like Sane is going to crash during team of the season. There's going to be so many options. Maybe EA are going to throw out some five-star skill upgrades. We don't know. And we've got foot captains as well as the next promo. So, yeah, it's, it's going down. I was looking at Mbappe, though. I must admit. And, and I know this is like pure sweat, but 3.2 million. If we can't get hold of his play of the month version, maybe we want to like play with the team of the year. To Mbappe alongside... R9, is that a little bit too filthy? Probably. All right, I, I gotta control myself. But 900,000, I did say that we have to go and splash out on the team. Kalajuri's getting a plus one. So fantastic news. I think I will be using him. It's just what formation. I can't really settle on anything right now. But Ken, I played a fair amount of games. Uh, 13 matches, three goals, <laughs> three goals, 10 assists. His finishing, I think his finishing was fine. Uh, like, it wasn't that bad. It's just that he was feeding R9. That's just how my team is playing right now. You feed the best player in your squad and he gets the goals. But tennis is, I feel like obviously he's nowhere near the level of the old Ryan Ken that broke the game on Fever 20, but very, very fast. Good aggression on the ball, which is nice to get back on those 50-50s. His finishing was fine when he was in positions to score. And his dribbling, he has like some shifty control. Like if you're using that RB as well, like he can really cut past the players. He's not bad. For 100,000 coins for a bit of fun, throwback, flashback. I think he is maybe worth picking up if you're all about that nostalgia. Other than that, maybe pass on him. If you, if you don't really care about Ryan Ken, then just, just pass on the guy. But he's all right. He is most definitely playable just not at that level that he used to be and three goals it does look quite bad but r9 you know 18 matches 31 goals four assists ruthless unbelievable but it's all about patching this team together marquinhos played really well so it's just trying to figure out what formation what striker and what tactics leave it with me well no maybe leave it with me help me no help me but who do i have as a striker We'll find out. But thank you very much for watching. Thumbs up. And I'll see you guys very, very soon. Team out. Peace.